Hey guys, I wanna share with you an awesome app for really stepping up your mobile videos. It's a filtering app that does all sorts of really, really cool effects. So when you post to social media, your videos will look mwah, amazing. My name's Jen Jager. If you're interested in knowing what's hot in video, make sure you subscribe to my channel. So let's talk about this amazing app. It's called Filto and there's a free version and a pro version, which I think is like $2 a month. This video is not sponsored. I don't have an affiliate link. I just really like this product and I wanted to share it with you. So let's take a look at how it works. When we open the Filto app, I'm just gonna click over to videos. You can edit your photos or videos. Obviously, I like to talk about videos. Let's pick this one here, my friend Bauer, that we shot in the studio. And the first thing you wanna do is just kinda like trim up your shot so you're just, you're just getting, you know, the meat of your shot that you wanna share. So once we've done that, there's a lot of things you can do with Filto that I think are really cool. The first one, let's hit the speed button. And what's great about this is that you can use the sliders to section just a very specific part of your video and then either slow it up or slow it down. So it almost like time warps. So it'll play in regular speed and then like speed up in the middle and then go back to regular speed. Let's do four times. And so watch that again, fast, fast, fast. Very cool. So for this particular video, I'm not gonna use that speed effect. I just wanted to show it to you because I think it's super cool. You can reverse the action, you can rotate it. Um, then you can just hit the reset button if you wanna undo everything you just did. But now let's go to where it's really cool and hit this pink button called Beautify Videos. So you're gonna see here at the bottom all of these different filters. Now, again, I'm on the pro version and the pro version gives you, you know, tons and tons of filters. If you just got the unpaid free version, you would have fewer filters to work with, but it's still worth downloading. I still think this app is pretty cool. And I just want to show you some of like what I think are really the coolest features. If you click this basic button here, you'll see that it opens up and you can have all these different color effects just kind of like Instagram or anything else you've seen, I'm actually going to take those off. I don't think those are the most exciting for me personally. And I wanna just kind of show you what I do think are really interesting looks. Let's scroll on over to fantasy. And I love this, you can add sparkles. Once you hit that button for sparkles, you can uh, pot down or up the intensity of your filter. We can close out of there to remove it. But what the one I really liked was called Sunshine. And it adds like this really cute rainbow. I really do think that's adorable. Another filter that I really love is called Gradual. These are actually gradients, pre-built gradients, which I'm super into. If you've seen my trends for 2020 video, you know that gradients are in. And so I really love the look of these gradients. And again, you can change the intensity of the gradient. And another filter pack I really love is light. This one actually has animated light leaks that you can add to your video. And I think these are super cute. Now that we're done playing with the filters, let's check out effects because Filto has really, really, really cool effects and you can apply them to just certain deliberate sections of your video, which I love. You don't have to affect the entire length of your clip. So let's click on over to effects and you can see all of these really neat different effects previewed. So you've got different versions of a glitch. And if you want to apply these, what you do is cue up your white playhead here to the part of the video that you want to affect. And then you're actually going to hold your finger down on the effect at the bottom of the screen there. And the video will play and the effect will apply to the video for the duration that you hold down your finger. Let me show you how. Let's start with this first one. And there you go. So you can see how it looks there. I'm going to undo that one and show you some other cool effects. It has kind of a prism effect. It's called lo-fi. This is a really neat one where it changes the color effect. 
There's also really cute overlays that you can apply, like confetti, blossom. So I think these are all really super cute and definitely step up your game. There's another filter that I really want to show you that's so on trend for 2020 and Filto does a great job with it. I'm going to import another video clip that I think will really showcase this shot. It gives you kind of a really cool monochrome look. I shot this clip when I was riding in the car through the Wynwood neighborhood of Miami, which is world famous for its outdoor art all over the buildings in the neighborhood. And some of the filters in Filto look awesome on this clip, so I really want to show you. All right, so now we've got this cool shot imported into Filto. I'm gonna hit the highlight filter, and what this does is it'll grab just one individual color from my frame, make everything else black and white, and then anything, in this case green, is gonna stand out. For this particular shot, denim is definitely the way to go. How cool does that look? And it is so on trend for 2020. The other one I really like for this type of shot is if you click on over to art and look at this, you can make it like a comic effect. And it actually looks like a cartoon or illustration. The anime one is amazing. So I would definitely recommend thinking about the kind of shot that you're working with and applying effects that kind of make more sense for it. You know, that anime one might not work as well for a real person and the kind of light leak effects might get lost on a busy shot like that Winwood one. So really just like think strategically about how you're gonna apply these effects. The one thing I don't love about Filto is that it really is just taking one individual clip and applying cool filters to it. You can't sew together a whole storyline within Filto. So what you wanna do is save your affected clip to your camera roll and then bring it into an editor like InShot, which if you don't know about InShot, I made a whole video about it. I'll link to it here. It's an awesome mobile editing app. So Filto isn't like your one-stop shop for all your video needs, but it is awesome in terms of filters. I don't know of any other app that I've seen that I think has such on-trend, cool filters and so many of them. So if you thought this video was good or you know of another app that you think I should be checking out, let me know in the comments, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you next week.